this video is about a calculator which I have made. Suppose if you have a calculator and a unit calculator and I have made a 3D type of unit calculator which can calculate in three different modes and you can get the answer and if you want to get a different sort of answer if you have a total and if you can deal want to get the division amount so it can do in a three way way so we can also get something if you have an answer over here and so this is a three way calculator which i have created and um, a VAT calculator also so the problem here now is the thing is this is in VAT calculator mode let me exit this you can see it's a VAT calculator file but when I have to open a new file and when I want to have a new book so you know the process of doing the calculator is time consuming you know if you want to make a calculator I have to go to the codes and I have to go to form and so you can see that calculator is my book and here you can see this is a calculator over here so I, I don't have time to make this calculator in each and every worksheets or workbooks so if you can see that if i want to have the same calculator if, if you if i go to the new book that is called book one and you can see that if i want to go to the codes for book one you can see book one this is book one and you can see this is only two things are here but for that calculator book you can see that we have forms and modules and forms and all those stuff so this video i'll be telling you if you have a book one how to get this calculator in the new books so it's a simple way go to the vat calculator so let me show you again this is book one this is vat calculator from here also you can go to f11 you can go to view codes and from here you can see under this project you can see that under this project is module and this is called for VAT calculator and this is for the book one so it's a simple step this is your calculator just click here and drag and drop it over this area so you can see now forms have been created and in the forms you can see VAT percentage frame calculator has been created so you can see the calculator is also in the new book so if I close this and you can see here already there is a calculator in this book also so if you want to go to the calculator either you can draw go to the developer draw a form and you can see the calculator has been created here in sheet 2 and you can say ok so from this button you have to assign a macro you have to assign a macro so you can see the calculator has been there in the book 1 and you can see the and it also here about the condition and uh, you can see it's working here also the right amount and the total is here so i hope you find this video useful so many people are getting issues when they have to uh, transfer the files or the certain calculators or whatever they are from the one sheet to another so it's a simple way you have to go to uh, from anywhere you can go to hit f11 and go to view codes and from view codes you can just drag and pull it from here to here in a simple way i don't think many videos are there in this uh, for this item so i hope you find this video useful Please share your comments and give me your feedback and thanks for watching this see you in the next video